Kevin, ever since I decided to give my life to God, to begin following his rules and regulations, it seems like living for God is much more difficult. Why is this? You have to understand when you begin to live for God, and I continue to receive emails and comments about this, when you begin to live for God, demons are going to try to stop you from doing it. Think about it. If your enemy did not cause you any type of harm or irritation, would that person be your enemy? Think about it. Demons. A demon would not be a demon if they did not harass you, harm you, or irritate you in some type of way. What if there is a demon <laughs> that did not harass you, irritate you, or harm you in some type of way? You can say that that demon <laughs> is a horrible demon. Perhaps you may not be able to call that entity a demon. So when you try to get out of the rut that you are in now, when you try to live for God and do things right, of course, demons are going to harass you. That is to be expected. But even though we still have to resist. So yes, you are going through a hard time now, especially if you are trying to change your life. That is to be expected. But the thing that you have to do is keep on pushing. Think about it. A demon would not be a demon if they were not doing what they are doing to you now. Is there a such thing as a harmless demon? I think not. Is there a such thing as a helpful demon? I don't think so. So, <laughs> yes, when you begin to live for God, they are going to raise hell. Yes, that is to be expected. But the more you resist, the more that you are tested, and when you pass those tests, you are going to excel in God. This is the only way. God bless you.